Okay, so this is my first try on with the Pendleton wool shirt. I gotta admit, I'm a little bit disappointed in this pattern. Um, it's ginormous. I know I added to it to, to guide it up to my size, but still, I mean, it's absolutely huge. It's longer than I anticipated. Um, a lot wider in the shoulders. I mean, the shoulders are just falling off the mannequin. This is a size eight and I graded it up to a size 20. So I, it's going to be bigger, but uh, usually there's some sort of structure here in the sleeve. I hate these pleats. I haven't stitched them down yet um, because I wasn't sure about them. And after putting it on here, I absolutely hate it. Uh, I'm not sure I might just take those out completely. Um, the other thing is there's supposed to be pleats at the cuff and I'm not in love with those either. It's uh, on the front of the sleeve, which is kind of weird. Usually the pleats are at the back of the sleeve where the placket is. Um, I don't love that either. So I might change things up. I was looking at, this is the men's version of the vintage um, Pendleton shirt. And if you notice, there's no pleats at the shoulder just a smooth shoulder and no pleats at the cuff either. So here the cuff is just a little bit of gathering and it just looks like a cleaner finish to me. So I think I'm going to change my mind a little bit and uh, use those details on my shirt instead. Um, the other th difference is of course the men's shirt doesn't have the lower pocket, it has the chest pocket which I don't love for myself either. Most women don't like um, chest pockets, but uh, I don't know. I'm just not loving anything about this right now. It kind of looks like the smock that my art teacher used to wear when I was in the third grade. So there's that. All right, I'll have more later. Bye.